the Russians are coming. The Russians are coming. Famous movie for the 60s. And uh, Demchenko is up now. Ivanova coming up in a little bit. They both come off of very disappointing weeks in Innsbruck, but both are perennial World Cup medalists over the last few seasons. Yeah, they had a very disappointing finish in Innsbruck. Bronze medalist in last year's World Championships. Yeah, big and, and a daughter of another only two time medalist. Olympic medalist. Victoria Albert. finished eighth last week in Innsbruck in the two heat race, back in 15th and last in the sprint. Well, you line up Prock, you line up Zegler, and you line up Vinchenko. There's some Olympic hardware hanging around there. Now. Ooh, that's really high. The medals, and this is uh, the first crash wow. we've seen. She Just maintains contact with the sled. That's a good early sign, John. That means she at least has the presence of mind, and now she wants to get back on that sled. Sure, she wants to finish. She wants to finish. Uh, she'll be the first person to go unless someone else crashes, but uh, wow, Tim, it's like she fell asleep. You know, the 11-12 combination wasn't that bad. We were telling the story about her father, and uh, well, Wow, she finished, wow. So good for her, and she is one of the gutsier athletes, John, and uh, the story with Demchenko, uh, in scattered amongst her podium finishes and top fives, have been a series of spectacular crashes over the past several seasons, and she always finds a way to get back on that sled. That's 12, that's where the problem started. And wow. Just. 11-12 combination is two, that two corner combination I say is as tricky as any other track in the world. Lake Placid's got a couple, Whistler's got a couple up there with the 50-50 curve. But 11-12 in Altenburg, boy have I seen action there in the course of the three decades I've been